The state's tax department is still dealing with landlords who are not paying their fair share of the general excise tax. And as our Dwayne Chimogawa reports in this Island News investigation, tax department officials are now getting more aggressive in finding who is still not following the law. It's a story that's all new at 6. Here at the state's Department of Tax Office, compliance officers continue their investigations as they look to collect millions in tax revenues from those who are not paying their taxes. Everybody needs to pay their fair share and the tax department would like to work with them as much as possible. The special enforcement section at the tax department has 12 people looking for those in the community not paying their required tax obligations. This includes general excise taxes that landlords have to pay for renting out their properties. During the COVID-19 pandemic, many renters who applied for rental assistance were not granted funding because their landlords did not have a GET license and thus not paying taxes on their rentals. Zane tells Island News that the tax department has seen a gradual increase in the amount it's been collecting as it continues to go after those who are not paying taxes. For instance, $38 million was collected in the previous fiscal year, and in this last recent fiscal year, $44 million was collected. They're not stopping there, as more investigators may be on the way. As we bring in people and we get them trained and everything, um, that should sustain the momentum. Um, so that's what we're looking forward to. The special enforcement section has sent out thousands of letters to landlords reminding them of their obligation to get a GET license. Nearly 40% of this total were earmarked for further research and follow-up. Of these, about a dozen were found to be unlicensed, non-filers or requiring further investigation. There used to be an old marketing campaign called S-T-E-M, right? Shoplifters take everyone's money. Uh, the same is true for people who don't pay their taxes. Um, the government still costs, uh, and the rest of us who are paying taxes have to pay it. The tax department also wants to remind those who are not paying their fair share that they will be penalized. In this case, a late filing fee of up to 25% of the total amount that's due along with interest. We need to have people understand that, you know, we've got a society, we've got, you know, laws and, and they need to be enforced. And there are consequences if you break them. In Honolulu, Dwayne Shimogawa, Island News.